The reason why you clicked on this video is because you want to get rid of this and I'm gonna show you how you can do it. What's going on guys, this is Applefax channel here and in today's video I'm gonna be showing you how to delete or how to turn off the passcode on the Apple Watch. So if you are new to the channel, start by clicking the subscribe button so you won't miss anything important in the future because on this channel I make a lot of videos about the Apple Watch and about Apple tech in general like iPhones and that kind of stuff. First of all, I have to say that there may be two types of people that are watching this video. First of all, there are the people that want to get rid of the password that they have set up on the Apple Watch and they know the password basically. So whenever they see the screen, they know what to type in. So if you go like this, you get inside. And if you want to do this, if you want to get rid of the passcode in this point of time, when you know the actual passcode, you need to do this. So just like you have the Apple Watch right now, you need to swipe down or basically find the settings icon on your Apple Watch and open it up, of course. And as you can see here on the bottom of this page, you can see that we have the option that says passcode. So you have to click on it and you have the option to turn it off. So you, of course, click on it. You actually have to get through this page, type in the passcode and wait for the Apple Watch to actually recognize that something like this even happened. And now if you come back to the home screen, and now you can get inside the Apple Watch without any problems, without the need to type the passcode in. So it is as simple as that. But I believe that more people are watching this video because they don't remember the passcode. They want to get rid of this. So what you need to do then, so then you need to follow these steps. So as you can see, the Apple Watch looks like this, but when you're trying to type the password in, it doesn't do anything or it basically doesn't get you inside because the password or the passcode is wrong. So when you do not remember the passcode, you need to hold down to the power button on the right side of the Apple Watch and wait for this screen to show up. I mean, just like you would want to turn off the Apple Watch, it is the very same thing. And as you can see, we have this page where Emergency SOS is at the bottom, we have the cancel button at the top, and also this slider power off. So we have to perform a 3D touch on the power off option, or basically force press on it. So when you go like this, you can see that if I let it go, you can see I have the option to erase all content and settings or cancel at the bottom. So this here is the option we all have been looking for and it is really useful that something like this is even possible because you don't even have to have your iPhone around, you know, like it is not required in this process. So what you have to do now is click on this big red button that is basically going to erase all content and settings. As you can see right here, it's going to delete everything, but of course the password as well. But when you click on it, you can see that I have to connect it to power in order to proceed. So you have to bring up the Apple Watch charger. So right now, as you can see, I have the charger right here. So if I go like this, you can see, or you're going to be able to see that the Apple Watch is being charged right now. So I have to do the very same thing, but this time when the charger is connected. So of course, perform the 3D touch and let it go. And as you can see, we have the very same option right here. So let's click on it. And this time we have this screen that is actually a lot different than what we could see before. So we have this basically warning that if we will continue with this, all of the content, all of the things will be erased from the Apple Watch and this step can be undone. So click on this green icon if you want to proceed, but I don't want to because I basically remember the passcode and I'm just showing it to you. So I'm gonna click on this icon right here. And this is the end of this video, guys. I want to say thank you very much for watching until the end. I know that it was quite a quick video, but I just want to give you this tutorial because many people have been struggling with this. And you know, like you can easily forget the password or the passcode of the Apple Watch. Anyways, if you want to see more videos about the Apple Watch, iOS reviews, as well as some other iPhone related videos, then you should definitely click the subscribe button to the Apple Fox channel because I post a lot of those. So have a nice day and see you in the next video.